welcome back to another video hello friends today we are outside of Dollar Tree and we are on the hunt for stocking stuffers for everything cruise related we're gonna go on the hunt in the store take a look and see what we can find so we can stuff those stockings this season we got our Christmas vibes going on Christmas music's playing we're feeling festive let's go inside and take a look if you're new here by the way my name is Alana I love to do videos all about cruise news cruise vlogs cruise live streams so much more so be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you don't miss another video let's go inside and take a look and look they even have holiday extended hours Ooh, more time to shop all right so walking right on in i feel like we should definitely start with the stockings uh, just in case you are uh just in case you don't have one that you want to stuff a stocking with or if you're giving it as a gift and you want to just not wrap it you could throw everything in these stockings they have quite a bit to choose from so it's probably numero uno where we should stop if you don't have one <laughs> So one thing that would be a great stocking stuffer is some of these travel size uh, shampoos and conditioners. So this is pretty great. They are actually travel size since they are only 2.5 ounces. You can have those with all the different types of fun smells, throw one of them in there, and then you don't have to worry about bringing a huge shampoo and conditioner. And if you think you would need more than that for your cruise, you know, say you have really long hair and your cruise is seven days long, you know, you could just give them two of them or, you know, a different variety but it's a great it's a great start all right here is another last minute gift idea these are some earbuds now uh, granted the quality probably isn't going to be amazing on these but it's always helpful just to have an extra pair in case you have a long car ride to get to your cruise port or for the plane having some options and some different colors just in case because i feel like I lose earbuds all the time, so having an extra pair could be really handy in a stocking. So I generally always travel with some of these tumblers or these coffee mugs, and why not make one with it festive and throw it in the stocking as well? It's really great to kind of like go up to the Windjammer or the buffet, grab your coffee in the morning, and then you can walk around the ship, do what you gotta do. They even have some kid ones as well with like these little sippy cups in here so these are great and if you lose it you know it's only a dollar so i think these would be a great addition you could even open this up and then throw other things inside to save room too here's another idea these micro usb cables you can pop some of these different colors in your bag and then you don't have to worry about losing any extra cables and having an extra one in hand is always a good idea all right, so we're on the hunt. What else can we find that is cruise related for our stocking stuffers? Oh, take a look. Okay, so a lot of different type of cruises will have glow parties and things of that nature. So you can always have um, some extra glow sticks or glow necklaces. You can be the life of the party having these bad boys around your necks and your wrist. <laughs> a lot of fun. And, you know, you can even pick up a couple too and pass them out to people. Then really great way to make some friends on the cruise. <laughs> Over here in the stationery, we have all these different kinds of highlighters, and highlighters are always a good idea if you are one who likes to physically carry around the cruise planner, so you can mark up what you want to do on your cruise planner and kind of highlight it so you have it throughout the day. And then the other thing that you could grab are some sticky notes, because I know some people love to have sticky notes and kind of write it like, went to the... Um, ice cream bar, you know, be back in 15 and write it on the mirror in the cabin or what have you. So if you didn't have any of those on hand, you could pick up some of those as well. All right, so this is one item that I think a lot of people overlook is the toilet spray. So this is just the off brand of pooper, poopery. If you've ever ho heard of that, you spray it in the toilet before you go and it keeps it fresh. This stuff is really important for your small cabin bathrooms. So I would definitely recommend bringing some of this stuff and, you know, 
you'll have you don't you won't be going through this all throughout your cruise so you could be using this for multiple different cruises all right our next is clorox wipes uh definitely a good idea to carry these around these are a 13 count this little package this can easily fit in your day bag when you're on the ship um, if you wanted to get a bigger one or just pick up a couple that way you could wipe down your cabin if you're really worried ahead of time or just having it on hand for when you're out on port or wherever and you can wipe your hands and need be um, these are really great just to pick up and have on hand i carry these around in my purse anyway uh, when i'm cruising or not so definitely something good to to think about all right next up is some air fresheners now say you are in an inside cabin and you're worried about stale air you could pick up one of these little air fresheners and this would definitely last you more than a week of cruise so you'd probably be wind up bringing it home with you or just tossing it at the end of the cruise if you didn't want to bring it back home um, but good if you have an inside cabin i don't ever bring these so it's kind of unnecessary in my book but if you wanted to you could throw it in there as well if you know anyone who likes to do the crossword puzzles, I suggest you pick up one of these. These would be a fun activity for your at sea day and you can just have all these different options of different type of Sudoku and fun things. And then why not pick up a mermaid pen as well? If we're at sea, you could see a mermaid too. All right, I've also found in the same aisle, the tea lights. These are super helpful. I like to have these because sometimes it's hard to find your way to the bathroom. So these little tea lights come with a battery inside. You don't have to worry about that. You just need one to kind of light up the room if you have an inside cabin and say the bathroom light is too bright. You can turn this on, that way you can find your way to the bathroom. Actually, when I slept on a Pullman bed, this was really great as I was climbing down the ladder to go to the bathroom in the middle of the night. So if you have kiddos who are sleeping on a Pullman bed, this could be great because you don't want to fall off that bed or just stub your toe once you're getting out of the regular bed. I would get one of these. Oh, but take a look at this. I just found the jackpot. Here are some fun design ones, some stars in different colors. So if you didn't want to go basic, you could have some fun design tea lights. So I found some different types of lanyards as well. And this is a great thing to keep your CPAS card on. So you would just either have to get a little plastic pouch and you can clip it on right here. But these are uh, great little additions for perhaps any kiddos that are worried about losing their CPAS cards or adults. I mean, they have tons of different uh, styles and things like that. So you would just need the little plastic piece and then you're good to go. All right, so our next item is hand sanitizer. This is a good option to bring, keep in your purse, your backpack for your excursions. On the ship, you won't really need it as much because there's hand sanitizer everywhere and they make you wash your hands before you eat and everything like that. But for uh, additional to have on you when you're off the ship and on your excursions and just traveling in general, this would be a good stocking stuffer idea. And um, you know, two for the price of one here, there you go. So this is kind of funny because I love my scarves and I actually have way too many than more than I can ever wear. But we found some scarves that are really cruise themed. So we have little cactuses and watermelons and stuff on this one and then drinks. Look at these little fruity drinks. Super, super cute. And this one has fish all over it. So definitely like aqua themed and really cute. So if you wanted to just spice up a regular t-shirt or whatever and make it fun and travel and give you all those tropical vibes for your cruise why not pick up an extra scarf and this is really light this will easily stuff into a stocking all right now we are in the health and beauty and medicine aisle and this is where you want to have um, a definitely a stockpile of goodies in that stocking okay vitamin c i swear by it i take this stuff anytime i get on a plane anytime i'm feeling kind of sick on the cruise i love 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 to take this stuff so these packets are a pack of two here this is the orange flavor it tastes great just i can even drink these in cold water or hot water too and that kind of fizzes and if you were craving like a hot drink definitely recommend um, to have some of these on hand is really great whether or not you're feeling sick or you just want to be a bit preventative ahead of time and then the other things that i would recommend putting in a stocking is some advil some excedrin some other types of uh cold medicines just to have it extra on hand 
Uh, I feel like we're gonna need a bigger stocking than we thought, but these are just great things to have on hand for sure, just in case. And right next to it, I also found some earplugs. So this isn't totally necessary unless you're the snorer and you're gifting the person saying, sorry, you're gonna have to sleep with me and I'm gonna be a big snorer. But regardless, um, these could come in handy depending on if you winded up having a super noisy cabin or regardless, you never know. Here is the jackpot of items to add to that medicine bag. Would it really be a stocking if it wasn't full of candy as well? Sweetest fish? Fish? Cruise? I think it goes. <laughs> we can't say no to candy, can we? So we have more options here for water bottles as well. These pink and blue ones with a little snap on lid over here. Or maybe some ones with some little designs as well. Um, these are just great to have. Uh, I love to have water in my cabin and bringing a reusable bottle is just a great idea if you don't have the beverage package and you don't get unlimited water bottles or whatever. Um, just I always love to travel with my own water bottle and like I said, these are just a dollar so you don't have to worry about it. If you lose it somewhere, I know I've like left mine by the pool one time and you know, you don't have to worry about losing it. So if you didn't want to buy the other travel size uh, shampoo and conditioner and you wanted to use your own, they have these shower travel kits. So there's even a mini loofah in here, something, a little small container where you can put your own product in. And these are all travel size. And then they have some other ones as well. If you didn't want the loofah and the toothbrush holder as well in there. So uh, lots of different options for you to bring your own products. All right, the next thing that is helpful, if you don't like the taste of regular water, you can pack in your stocking some of these water flavor packets. Spice up your water and makes water a little bit more fun to drink. Um, this is really great, some low calorie ones. Arnold Palmer, half and half. Um, really kind of fun just to pack in, super light too. So I know some people really enjoy bringing these, so it could be a fun addition. All right, and for some reason, my Dollar Tree doesn't have the laundry clips. These are jumbo laundry clips that you can use to adhere your beach towel to your chair on the cruise ship so if it's super windy, you don't have to worry about it flying off and whacking your neighbor, your towel, and whacking your neighbor in the face. Um, these are a fun alternative. So cute, right? Um, these actually are really big too, like the opening of it is really big so I think this could also just be an alternative these are chip clips but they're super cute and the laundry ones that I've seen here before they don't have um, fun designs and things like that but if you wanted a fun design these are little duckies are super cute and it could work uh, just as good because I think they open just as big also if you wanted like different size style ones you could buy those on Amazon but a good dollar store alternative all right, this is the cruise jackpot. Look at these little anchors on here. Oh my God, I have to get these. <laughs> and then the other thing that would be really great for your cruise are these little eyeglass cords. So you can tie these on to your sunglasses, go swimming, get in the water, get on water slides, and you don't have to worry about losing your sunglasses or your glasses. Um, these are just a dollar, of course, at the Dollar Tree, and I paid, or my mom has paid $10 on a ship to get these so definitely want to grab those ahead of time huge savings what do we think styling I think so <laughs> it's we just got out of the Dollar Tree and I have to say I feel like we made out like bandits our stockings are gonna be so full full of all these fun cruise goodies I think our Dollar Tree had a lot of good items so let me know what you guys are gonna stock your stuffings with if you liked seeing this video, if you want to see more Dollar Tree cruise related videos, let me know in the comments below. I'd love to hear your thoughts. As always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please do give it a big thumbs up, subscribe for more, and until next time, ciao for now.